You know how if you kill someone, you go to jail? Well, there is a crime, yes. If you abuse them, you don't go to jail. Uh, yeah. If I broke someone's legs, I'll go to jail. Mm -hmm. That's assault and battery, so, yeah. If I slap them, I've still assaulted them, but I probably won't go to jail. Yeah, not likely. Where's this going? Just, just, there's a, there's a point here, okay? If I break someone's legs, I go to jail. And there's like a cutoff point, yeah? Beyond which, I go to jail. Before which, like in the case of abusing and slapping someone, I don't go to jail, right? Well, man, what is happening? Shh, just listen, this is important. So there is a point. If instead of breaking the leg, I bruise the leg, or I break a toe, there's a line. That's what I'm trying to say. I just want to know what is that line? Because I want to inflict as much pain and suffering as possible without going to jail. I mean, what if it's four slaps? Yeah? Two slaps, very painful. And then the other two, not so painful, but just, you know. Humiliating. Yeah? If I do those four slaps in a day, does the clock reset for each day or do they accumulate? Because you can't go to court and say, Your Honor, he slapped me 40 times when I actually slapped you just four times a day. Okay, what did he do this time? You know what? Don't tell me. Because if it's a very petty reason, I am going to judge you so much. Oh. You're probably going to be even more pissed off than I am if you knew what it is. You know how we over time has never find sugar? Like, no, I don't even know why that company does. Are they putting us on a diet? I saw him. I saw him. He comes in at exactly 6 o'clock and he puts the sugar in a bowl. What do they call those things? A good tiffin. He puts it in a tiffin and he takes it home. And then for us now, we have to drink chai and curry. Slapping him four times, let's spread the slaps around. Get like 12 people, give him 12 slaps at the back of his head because legally that's not a slap. 